Hey guys, welcome to Swift Intuition. It's your girl, Mercy. If this is your first time on my channel, please like and subscribe. Hit that notification button if anything does ignite. So today we're going to do a general and we're just going to get into this energy. Messages of love and life are a beautiful collective. Messages of love and life are a beautiful collective. I don't know if this one wants to come out. We have the Seven of Cups. So the Seven of Cups tells me that um, there is about to be a lot of options coming in. Um, because the Cups deal with feelings, I feel like there's about to be a lot of love options coming in for you guys. It could be job opportunities or just options in love. Um, I see a lot of passion coming in. Um, just these bubbles remind me of like friendliness. So I feel like you're about to have uh, come into contact with a lot of different people in different um, aspects of work. So if you normally, um, let's just say you would normally work in the oil and gas industry, you're probably gonna find, start talking to people like in transportation, traveling, it's just gonna be something totally different from what you're accustomed to. Messages of love and light. Yeah, and because of the water, I feel like this is gonna be something that you really enjoy. I see right now with the cherry card, you're moving away from something. I feel like you're moving away, moving away from options. What is this I'm seeing? Yeah, it's like you're heading toward this wheel of fortune. Something is about to move in your favor. I feel like that's going to create better options than what you have right now. Mm. Yeah, we have the hermit card. I feel like for a while you've been in... Um, Mm. I feel like a while you've kind of went into yourself or somebody has gone into their self. Uh, they pull back their energy, probably haven't been communicating with you if this is uh, somebody else. And I feel like it's because they were trying to figure out what they wanted. And if this is you, if you were one of their options that they were going in thinking about, they haven't been they haven't been talking to you. I feel like at this time, once you started moving away, now this person, now this person is like coming. I feel like this person is coming towards you with the lover card next. It's like this person is uh, coming out of her memo wanting to head towards you. Because at the end of the day, clearly you were the only option. Let's just live in light. We have the moon card. So the moon card speaks of hidden feelings. I feel like you have somebody in your past that haven't been talking to you. And I feel like, like they've been uh, in the past, they probably kept you at as an option and now at this present moment you're moving away. like i feel like you've been moved away from them because with with how her face is looking it's like like she was well she could see it uh, it's not gonna show it but her face is like ugh, and um like like oh how dare you think i'll be one of your options and right now i feel like what she's dealing with she has some type of love on her mind so you could have somebody your person i mean you you could have somebody else and somebody from your past is trying to come in to create this love dynamic but with the wheel of fortune things are going in your favor and i feel like there are some feelings with this person that are about to be uncovered like if the person that you're currently dealing with um like hasn't been saying their feelings at this time i feel like they're about to move forward we have the six of ones so the six of ones is speaking of success your person wants success with you actually if you're dealing with two people well you could be currently talking to one uh currently you could currently be have one on your mind and like let's say you could have briefly uh broken up or something like that but they're in you but they're they're who you're thinking about now but you have an additional person from the past who who had a lot of options and they had chose someone else in in the past and they're coming towards you too wanting success with you but i see this new part this this the newest person, they're they're wanting this love and they want to <laughs> they want success with you. Okay, we have the uh, the three of cups. It looks like it came in reverse. I'm gonna take it both ways. I feel that 
you have two people want to reunite and I feel like with one person you want to reunite with which is the person that you're with now and this other person you're like I'm not interested I don't even know why you came in to talk to me yeah that's that's what it is and then we have the hangman in reverse so that mean you're sure in your decision you know exactly what you want and who you want and right now whoever the person is from the past past who chose other people over you you're like i don't want them and whoever you're dealing with now probably currently going through a little uh whatever breakup uh you know that that's what you, that's who you want if you have to choose you choose them okay spirit let me uh clarify this moon spirit what is the moon card okay so the moon card is your person your new person wants your persons want to make this official i feel like they haven't been sharing their feelings especially the recent one the the person that you're currently uh wanting to be with um the moon card is here because they haven't been showing their feelings and what they want what they're going to bring in the in the near future is official person so this 22 equals four so four is balance this is like um this person wants to make you guys relationship official if it was, if y'all broke up, they want to make it official or so it's like, yeah, this is like an elevated relationship that they want. Spirit, what is the, um, what is the three of cups? The three of cups is ending situation. So new and convinced. So I feel like you have a person from your past that wants, um, a person from your past that wants your energy, that, that wants to come back into contact with you. And you have a person that you're dealing with right now that, that it wants to reunite rekindle some things and i feel like you're going to end one with the person from the past uh and the person that you're currently dealing with i feel like the way you guys did things the first go around you're going to end some of those things so that a new beginning could come to fruition all right collective that's it wait let me get uh a few thoughts from your person give me two. messages 11 light you are my destiny. So the person that you're recently separated from, they want you to know that they feel like you are their destiny. So they know now that this is a um, a connection that is tied. I need you and your pure love. Your person is in love with you. And I don't think, and I feel like this is something else they haven't told you. Like your person is in love with you and, uh, and they feel that what you're bringing to them is pure. I feel like for some of y'all, your person could, could, could have, could have had, a, could have a lot of people around them, like could have had a lot of, uh, women or, or men and their your person is attractive. And it's like people were after certain things. I feel like the way you love them, it was like, it, 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 it wasn't it wasn't toxic meaning it wasn't uh arguments it wasn't uh nitpicking it was just pure like you okay like some good loving and I feel like your person is seeing this and under the bottom it says spiritual growth so i feel like the separation that you and your person could have had your person is actually growing spiritually and uh and 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 i feel like when they come back well it's already showing they want to come back and they want to make things official now and you got somebody else in the past that you're not even looking at that's trying to come back in so whatever all right y'all like and subscribe hit that notification button if anything resonate how <laughs>